patient issue. This is mild-mannered Chris Phelps. He's a 20-year-old ACC student and cameraman at WNCE TV8 in Glens Falls. Now meet his alter ego, Banana Boy. He's a crime fighter and cast member of TV8's sketch show, The Ravicon. We always are, are coming up with characters and coming up with situations. And this was just one of the ones that we, one of the ones that people take notice, took notice to. While shooting a fight scene in Hudson Falls Thursday, a Washington County Sheriff's deputy noticed Banana Boy and two members of his bunch. The deputy mistook the act for a real knife point attack and immediately took action. All of a sudden we just heard screaming and I looked over and there was the gun pointed at me. And like, I don't know, it's, that's such a, it was such a serious moment for me. So I immediately dropped the knife and kind of put my hands up and took off my wig and mask. Phelps oh, says he too broke means, character. Okay, but if he was still being Banana Boy, he would have, well, split. Banana Boy in the situation would probably not you know, he'd probably fly away if he thought he was going to be arrested, but Banana Boy wouldn't actually be arrested. But Chris Phelps and his crew were arrested and charged with disorderly conduct. And in character or not, they'll be in Hudson Falls Village Court on December 15th. But like most superhero stories, Phelps says this one too teaches a valuable lesson to all make-believe crime fighters. Well, I guess we just got to be more cautious on what we're doing. The real crime fighters agree with Banana Boy. The officer who came upon the scene said he saw a large crowd and a man with a knife and at that point did what he was trained to do. And at the end of the day, the misunderstanding is resolved and everyone's safe. Just how Banana Boy would have wanted it. In Glens Falls, Ken Juby.